All right. Here we go. This is the... Uh, well, that's already on fire. And we spawn near a village. That's awesome. Is the sun going up or down? Well, obviously, it's going up since it's the morning. Anyways, uh... Yeah, this is my, uh... First ever hardcore world. Well, not the first, but uh, this one will be the most dedication filled. Like I said in the intro, I have a lot of plans for this world. And I hope I don't die before achieving at least one of them. And if you're wondering, wait, nerd, how did you spawn next to a village? Are you using a set seed? Yes and no. See, the thing is, I'm, I use this website called uh, chunk base i uh, i use that site to generate like 16 worlds in total and i checked every single one of them this one seemed the best so of course there's a blacksmith so that helps and yeah let's just let's just start and first things first uh, obviously we check out the blacksmith oh that's really good That's nice. We've got a few mods here and there. It's mostly client-sided. Except for like I have one data pack called Towns and Towers. I'll post the mod pack in the in the description. Uh, but yeah, let's get collecting wood. So yeah, the, we're good on food because they have a lot of hay bale. And obviously I'm going to steal all of it. It's not like they're going to eat it. Are they? Nah, they don't like bread. Also, oh, oh that's interesting. Oh, that is also interesting. Alright, first tree. And I think I'm also using some vanilla tweaks. Oh uh, yes, I am using because there's this uh, one data pack for in vanilla tweaks that that like breaks the whole tree as soon as like you you get all of it. Is there a safer way to get stone? I don't want to fall down. Also, one more thing. I generally, I use a lot of swear words in my videos and streams. I'll, uh, I'll try not to do that this time. You know, Minecraft is more of a... You just look at Minecraft and you're like, but it's Minecraft. Well, obviously, it's Minecraft. It is Minecraft. But my point is, uh, do not use bad word. I do not support cryptocurrencies. And I'd also like to take some time whilst I'm mining to give credit to demon joe tv he's the one who inspired me to do this series i mean we don't know each other he's he's a youtuber a pretty big one at that i'm i'm pretty small when it comes to being a youtuber but yeah he's a he's good he started a hardcore series it's like a vanilla plus series and he's got a got an interesting world so yeah check him out even though it's not going to be of much help to him because you know i don't have a lot of viewers just yet but credit where credit is due his hardcore world is incredibly interesting he's building all sorts of like cults and stuff i mean he's giving his world some lore and it's i like lore lore is nice and his world in general is is, is really good because he's he's a fantastic builder let's just take all the iron we can because iron is is always useful so yeah, I'll just uh, be careful and get armor as fast as possible. Oh, I so want to go and visit that thing. But not before I have a bucket at least. And it's the very first day of the world. Let's not overcomplicate things. by Because of course I want to do everything. Yeah, I want uh, an elytra and everything. But I'll, I'll j I just prefer if, uh, if everything is like slow and steady instead of fast and... Uh, unsteady and the villagers are going to sleep that means i should do no it's my house dang it okay i'll just find a different one it's okay it's okay villager you can stay that looks like a nice house what is that bobbing thing do you see that how could you be a shepherd and not have a bed excuse me sir i'd like to sleep in your bed i like this uh, i like this advancement mod it's nice. Is this the blast furnace house? It is the blast furnace house. I'll take that. Thank. No, 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 no. Hell yeah. This this looks like a nice little area. 
We'll just clean it out. This is good enough for now. I'll put that. And it's a home. And then I'll just put the, the other furnace right here. I meant the blast furnace, not the other furnace. And I'll smelt some iron. Okay, I got uh, 19 iron. 19 plus... I think I should be able to make full set of armor. I would also like to mine. Because, you know, it's a... Mine craft. And a shield would be also be very nice. Okay, can I just... Uh, no! No! Do I also have a helmet? I also have a helmet. I can't believe I just did that. And that's all the iron. Well, you know what? I think... I think I'm uh, ready enough to... Check out the, the fortress. Not the fortress, the, the pillager outpost. And yes, I will be filling all of these holes eventually. Zigzag, zigzag! Ah! Uh, where is the entrance? There it is. Alright. I think this is as safe as it gets. No, no. Alright. Oh, nice! Is this a new trim? I, I'm pretty sure it's a new trim. Feel, what is this? Why? Right, like, we got the worst one. <laughs> I'll take it. And uh, I'll take some wheat too. Don't really need those, but yeah, I, I think. I don't even know what this looks like on an armor. But let's let's take it. Also. I'll also take the chest. Because this is early game and early game. Okay. Why was he just ready to shoot? Alright, here's the strategy. I jump, I swim over there, and then I go over there and spawn. I don't even know what they're hiding in that in that like jail cell. I'm so glad I made that jump. I'm so glad. Thank you, Dolphin. Thank you. I'll also try to build as much farms as possible in the early days. But I will also make... But I also need a bucket, though. Hello, big man. It's still three blocks, right? All right, uh, I got five. Awesome. Though I should, should I just, uh, yeah, let's save the iron. Could be useful. Then put the iron there, keep the blocks, keep the torches. Now what I'll do is I'll collect all of the hay bale and use that as food. They don't need it. Look, if you pretend like villagers need food, you will never be able to eat. Stop feeling bad for villagers. I don't think anyone feels bad for the villagers, but it's my obligation as the streamer slash content creator to let people know that they shouldn't feel bad about inanimate things. In this case, villagers. That, that looks absolutely beautiful. It's a rainbow. I'm ready. I just need a, a shovel, but I don't have any wood. That one looks good. Thank you. That's exactly what I wanted to do. How did you know? Chickens. Very nice. Did I say chickens? 
Isn't chicken the the plural form of chicken? Or is chicken just one word? And then the this Then what is chick? Uh I'll bring a crafting table with me. You never know when you need it. Put the flower there, that there. I don't need a dirt. I don't even know why I have that. Let's get torches. Some blocks. A crafting table. And I think I'm ready. the cave it'll be like it never happened beach with a lava pool nice there's a kitty oh this is this looks so good the lava pool looks like a lily pad excuse me I'd like to sleep in your bed Okay, instead of maybe just digging straight down, let's do that instead. Yeah, I don't think that's a very good idea. Oh, it's a spawner. Not that far from spawn, I believe. Oh, la pizza. Nice. Yeah, skeleton spawner would, would have made things easier. That we could have gotten a lot of bone meal. Bone thingy. Was it just one? I thought there were like four. Alright, let's take a note. New zombie spawner. And then let's just take coordinates. Let's... Oh, let's go! Diamond horse armor. We don't even have a horse or a saddle. And beetroot seeds. Let's take those. You never know when they, they, they can be useful. And some uh, iron, a golden apple. And more bones. And redstone isn't really like that crazy of a deal. Because redstone is easy to find in any scenario. So this is where I was mining. And let's just continue this hole.
Okay. Okay. Wait, no, why am I running? I have a shield. Was that a second one? That was a second one. Can he? No, he can't jump, thankfully. That's what a strategist would have done. Alright, oh, the first diamond of the world. And the, yeah, I was hoping to find at least three. But actually, I was hoping to find at least five. Is there any more? I don't think so. Alright, that's five diamonds. You know what? That's not zero. Excuse me, sir! Are you stuck? Yeah, I'm definitely getting greedy. Don't even have full diamond yet. And uh, we're... Cobblestone, that looks like something I would do. And I'm going back up. Since... Uh... I think I'm done with mining for a while. We need a house. We, we, we live outside. We're not hermits. Yes, sir. All right, there goes all the cobblestone. Uh, so let's let's go straight. Uh, is this north? Facing, I do not understand this 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 mod honestly. Facing south, okay, so that's north. Ah, right, let's go south. How bad could south be? Editor nerd here. I said, how bad could south be? Let me tell you, it was the worst thing ever. I I I recorded like one hour and forty minutes worth of footage, and I found no spruce trees. But yeah, here are some highlights from that adventure. And I just need some redstone. Actually, let's take all and make one compass. That way we can get home easily. And then we don't need the iron anymore. Perfect. I just found the cutest little island ever. I don't need it. And like I said, let's focus on our wants, not on our needs. I think I said that wrong. Uh, I am like 73% sure that I looped back to spawn. It's just I I looped back. I looped back. Oh When will I ever find spruce? Well, I'll go in, in a different I'll go north. I don't care. I'll go north. This is why I didn't want to go south. Before going south, I said, well, what's the worst thing that could happen in south or something like that? And and that's exactly what happened. Something went wrong. I looped back. All the way back to, to where I started. Oh, there's a swamp close to spawn. That is so good. See, north is much better. That means slime farm coming soon. Dot TM. But that's good. Also, we're high up. That means... <gasps> Spruce was right there. Spruce. I'm, I'm not even like a hundred blocks from spawn. Spruce was right here. This is heaven. This is heaven. So we went south found nothing and then looped back somehow that's my stupidity but then we went north 
and not even like 100 blocks or maybe like 200 or 300 and and we found the and we found emerald ore this is great we found spruce we got just one sapling i think i'll look for a few more yeah there's one right there why didn't i go always go north when finding spruce I don't know why I took, I took like a long break to say that all. I don't even have like a speech problem, I just stutter because I don't know how to speak. What? I just came across one randomly while Shrooke looking for those? Dude, I'm telling you, north is the best direction ever. There is no way I found it. Freaking awesome, dude. I mean, obviously, I'm not going just yet. But yeah, it's it's great. Is this oak? Yeah, this is oak. I want that one. Hello, tree. Can I have your wood? Intense. Oh, there's the new dog variant too. Cool. All right. Home sweet home. We made it. I'll just put that there as well. And uh, I got spruce saplings. And I got an egg for some reason. Uh, Alright, so we got some saplings, spruce saplings, yesterday. And I would like to grow them. What? I thought that, oh, that was in the- I thought that was in the distance! I thought it already grew, I was like, what? There's no way. Doesn't it look like that? It looks to me. Whilst we wait, we should do some other things. I do want to build one of those automatic cobblestone farms. So what I'll do for now is... You know what I can do though? I can make like a string duper somewhere around here where the villagers don't go. I mean, they go everywhere. They're annoying. But yeah, that way we get a lot of string and that can be converted into wool. And the thing is, it's not even like a very hard design. And yeah, it, it is a bug slash glitch which will be fixed in the upcoming 1.21.2, I believe. But yeah, I'll I'll use that. See, aren't farms also exploits? Yeah, so why not use them? Uh, I don't think it's that difficult to build. Let me quickly just watch a tutorial. Here's everything you need to make a string duper. Uh, yeah, this is all you need but, and the pickaxe, but you already have that. Also, the block number is 7, not uh, 5, but yeah, so let's do it. Let's do a speed build. to lose any string that's all yeah this way majority of it is going in the chest it's nice i'll just keep this running for a while meanwhile let's take a look at those trees uh yeah let's just get the wood and then collect all of the saplings Alright, we got saplings. That's good. So this is a... Yeah, we got us. The string situation is now... Good. Let's not do that again. Let's not focus on our phone when we're, you know, running around. 
clearly because there's a bad What is that? What is all this? Well, let me just turn on the shaders for the cinematic epics. So we found something that is not what we were looking for, but this also looks cool. I didn't bring a bed, did I? Dang it. I in fact did not bring a bed. So it's, it, oh, it's like a ruin. <coughs> so what do we do about the sleep situation? Those things are spawning. Should I just start sailing back to the spawn? Let's do that. Because the only other way I can skip the night is by sleeping. Let's just throw away some stuff. I don't need two cobblestone. Apples I have plenty of. And... Uh, dirt I don't need. It would also be great to find the sheep, but that's not happening. Well, at least I made it home. If I go and quickly sleep, I should be okay. It's a brand new day, and there they are, enemies. I will rescue you, cat, don't worry. I still haven't found an amethyst geode, though, so that's something uh, we have to do. Let's do that. I then went on an adventure to look for the amethyst geode. And let's just say, I didn't find it for a very long time. Actually, let's just not say, I, I definitely didn't find it for a long time. Yes. Oh my god, yes, this is the best cave ever. I, I, yeah, this is the best, this is it, this is it, that's what I've been looking for. That's what I've been looking for. But there are people trying to kill me. You'll see me. Oh my god, oh my god. Oh my god. Uh, yeah, that was a bad idea. That was a bad idea. You can see that they're spawning even more zombies. Okay, I should eat first. Because a skeleton can just end the world. I should have also brought my golden apple. I genuinely hope this is not the end. Why is it just zombies in this cave? Let's just run. I'll just make a run for it. I'll just make a run for it. I'll just make a run for it. This is what I need. I'll just get what I need. And then I'll go. I just need the calcite. That's all I need. I'll take as much as I can get. And then we'll start our journey back. How do they just know I'm here? Well, I almost died twice. It was the second time I almost died. I think I should have enough though. I'll just mine some. Just to be safe and then I'll just make a run for it. There's no way I'm staying in this cave. Alright, so the trees have started growing. That's nice. And the bamboo is growing. We got a chest here in this field. This is where I'll be building the house. And these are the blocks I'm taking. So yeah, this is uh, the general block pellet. Uh, I still have to collect some stuff for the, the, the ground. And the dimensions I'm going for are uh, 9 by 13. So yeah, I hope this area is enough for that. If not, we can just, uh, you know, get rid of that thing. Terraform a little here. But yeah, we should be... Oh, we should be good.
well, the house is finished. It looks a bit crooked, and uh, yeah, it took a, a long time to finish this. Uh, other than that, let me just eat real quick. This is the house. I still have to do decorations and stuff. Uh, yeah, this is... I'm on the, like, third axe. And, and like, a new pickaxe, too. But yeah, this is, uh... The interior. I still have to, like, decorate this... Everything. But... Pretty much, yeah, this is the floor. I did the crisscross pattern. It looks nice. And on the sides, we have a little upstairs portion. And I believe this could be a nice bedroom. And then there's a balcony. I still have to place fences here, but again, I ran out. Aha, who would have thought? That's the house. We, we finished building the house. And yeah, thanks everyone for joining. Thanks for staying. This was the first episode of, of a potentially long Minecraft Hardcore series. So I appreciate your time and uh, I'll see you in the next one. See ya. Hello my dear nerds, welcome to another Minecraft episode. Uh, this is episode 2 and uh, don't worry about the diamonds, I did some off-camera mining. So that's, that's, <laughs> is, is that true? That's delightful. Um, <laughs> you know, what? Is that actually, that actually happened? I th of course it happened. I think I think this is a reflection of how like... No, actually I, uh, I did a stream on Twitch whilst I was uh, recording but let me tell you something about streaming on Twitch. Uh, I, I used this software called Streamlabs for streaming. And then I proceeded to hate on Streamlabs after that. Yeah, I'm switching back to OBS. I'm currently using OBS for recording. And uh, yeah, basically what I did on that stream was I uh, decorated a little. I started a starter farm right there. And uh, I got a bed, but this is not the bedroom. This is this is going to be the workshop, and I'm I really want to build a bedroom upstairs. Here, oh yeah, and we built a Nether portal. I like nothing to do with with like Nether stuff just yet because it's way too early in the series. But yeah, I just wanted to see what the other side looks like. And let me tell you, this this Nether is is actually really good. Okay, let me also break the portal because I don't want things to pop out. But yeah, it's a, it's a soul sand valley, a pretty open space. That's good. And uh, there's also piglins, not piglins. There's also a, a crimson forest nearby. So it's it's really good. I like how the Nether looks like. And this armor I got from villager trading. And which villager trading exactly? I used the string in the string duper to sell to the Fletcher and nothing is off camera i i did everything on stream uh i just had to delete the footage of of that stream because uh the bitrate was like lower than my will to be happy oh yeah whilst we wait uh i have a goal for for this episode it's well obviously to get get full diamond armor and tools hopefully if 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 uh, if my luck allows that and another thing I want to do is I want to build something. It, it'll be a religious site. I have the, the template of, of how many blocks it's going to be. So we're doing that in this episode. Also, I'm sorry if you hear uh, firecrackers in the background. I hope you don't because I have a pretty decent mic. Hello, Mr. Golem. Hello, Mr. Moo. Hello, String Looper. I still have a lot of strings. So in case you're wondering, I still haven't placed that block. I will. My god, this guy is, is expensive. Alright, and now we go see the armor guy. Hello, Mr. Armor. Uh, how much is a helmet? Oh, it's 19. Ah, well, give me a moment. A full set of diamond armor. Without spending any diamonds, look. I, I mean, I forgot, you, you still can't see the the helmet but yeah i'm wearing it i promise let's see where do i want to build that structure that i want to build 
I think on that little slope it would look good, but I, I need that area to be flat. Yeah, I guess this is better. It's it's far enough away. And uh, this... Yeah, let me just see what the terrain looks like. Let me just place a block. So this is the level we want. It's it's a bit of a grind, but in the long run, it'll, it'll be worth it. Plus, I'll get a lot of dirt, which I can use to fill up those annoying holes. Wow, I'm too energetic today. But before that, I want to get an enchanting table. Hmm, where should that be? I can put it around here, yeah? Not that far away, and I mean, it won't be like a full-on library, but I think this will be enough. So let's do this first, and then we can do that, because we will need some enchants on our tools. Because it's a lot of mining and crafting. Okay, finally, we have something to work with. All right, it's the next day. That means I can do what I wanted to do. Not that. Uh, I know it doesn't look very natural. <laughs> I'm not uh, good at uh, that part of the game, but for the most part, this is flattened out i think i guess i'll remove a little bit of this area too uh yeah i think this is perfect i just need to like remove the flowers i'll put them in my flower chest don't worry yes i have a dedicated flower chest all right now that that's done i also filled up a little bit of this hole it does not look natural i know i will try my best to make it look natural and that is still not <laughs> okay but yeah i'll make a path leading over there Yeah, it's perfect. It's perfect. I love it. Now that we have a path leading from the house to the enchanting place, time to build the actual enchanting place. And first things first, I I do need to collect a lot of leather, so uh, I'll have to kill a lot of animals for that. I guess let's get to it. Let's go 45 leather uh, that took about like seven minutes I think all right I got leather I just need a lot of paper now 45 times 3 whatever that is so I'll quickly sleep because the Sun is about to set and I do not want to fight any mobs uh, and after I wake up I'll I'll just get on collecting paper yes yeah, swamp has been really great for uh, for sugarcane I'm getting a lot there's, there's so much what is that wait this is the the data pack structure oh that looks so sick i need i need to see that what is this, is this a pillager outpost a birch log pile is this a pillager outpost i'm not sure there's lava cauldron there anything to, oh i'll take a sword why not since we're poor another chest oh let's go this is a pillager outpost Ponder. Is it a good one? Oh yeah, it's the best one. I'll take some free coal as well. Oh yeah, I need... Oh, what? Cookies. There's an LA here. Yo, I need those. I need those. This is this is great. I need those. That's perfect. And another seek. I think I already have that one. I, I do not have that one. Uh, transition time. 
Ta-da! Well, it, there's not a lot of that. I just got the books and that's and the lanterns. That's pretty much it. Okay, okay, okay. Pillagers are now spawning. Time to go home. Thank you, pillagers. Hello, froggy. I'll take you when I build a farm for frog lights. Uh, barely made it home. Well, what do you mean barely? I made it home. Without taking any damage, because they were all far away. But I got a lot of good loot. So let's go to the treasure chest. I think I might actually have the books I need for the, the enchanting setup. Let's see, I need 15 and 3. Yep, I just need 3 books. And that's uh, easily doable. Excuse me. Let's do paper and then books. Perfect. I have the books. I just need a uh, wood, which I also have. Uh, but first. Ah. Let's get decorating. But I still don't have a lot of lantern. Alright, nerds. I built it. I built the enchanting setup. And you're not gonna believe how good it looks. It's really good. Trust me. Alright, in my defense, I couldn't think of what to build. So I just made a very basic one this i hope i think this is level this is level 30 what efficiency that's it first enchant and then let's see forge oh, okay fortune three i i have to wait what fortune please be good please be good oh no it's just fortune you don't do, do not pick up a job block in my house <laughs> Okay, I've decided not to go to the nether just yet. I mean, I have like, okay armor. This is the only thing that's good. Uh, but yeah, I'm not going for quartz and I'm not going for uh, calcite. I'm going for diorite or polished diorite because it looks good. It's a good looking block. I don't know why people hate it. I don't want to waste levels. Okay, you know what? That's not bad. I'll take it. I'll take it. I think the sh efficiency f 2 is in is instant mining for uh, gravel and sand but not for dirt I'm pretty sure. Yeah, it's better. It's better. And when this breaks I'll uh, I'll just cry and get make up a diamond one. Oh yeah, Dex. Give the montage. <laughs> So the shovel just broke and uh, this is what we've got so far which is which is you know really good I think this should be enough if I just maybe I get rid of yeah well the plan was to get rid of this level as well yeah I don't think there's a lot of work left so what I'll do now is I'll I'll make up a diamond shovel and then enchant it over there Let's see what enchant am I getting. Efficiency 4, that's good. That's that's exactly what I want. Let me just start up the, the string farm. And then we can sell it to the guy. And then get some more XP. Because this is the, the only source of XP I have. Is through trading strings with the guy. I got a little bit of string. Not a lot, like a few stacks. And probably... Wait, what? You're not the... What? Where's the guy? What happened? Oh, come on, dude. I had a guy I was already trading with. What, did, did he get killed by a zombie or something and the other guy just claimed it? I don't understand. Oh, that is cute. I have to get all the sticks and then trade sticks with the guy. Of course, you're not gonna restock. It's time for you to sleep. I swear to God, some, some, some of the mechanics in this game make me so mad. This is why I was saying I need an iron farm, but I still don't have one. I guess it's time. Nah, I'm not going to the nether just yet. Though I will go and collect up some diorite, because it's one of the blocks I want to use. I found diorite.
I think I should have enough. If not, there's there's more. I, I can just get it. But yeah, for, for now, I think I won't need diorite for a good while. Well, besides this, the structure I want to build isn't like massive. So hopefully this is enough. And again, if it's not, then I'll just get more. It's not like diorite is any rare. Alright, I got the diorite. And oh yeah, I killed the cows. It's... I just didn't need the leather anymore. So yeah. I killed them. I mean, I still need wood and some cobble and some other blocks, so I'll collect those uh, tomorrow. All right, guys, it's day two. That means we need to get cobblestone and decide some other gray blocks, a lot of wood, and then we can start building. Uh, well, something happened and uh, basically my hard drive just died and uh, well, I I lost a little bit of footage, but that's not an issue. I bought a new one. It should be here in a couple of days and like the only footage we lost was like me collecting stone and cobblestone and, and diorite and andesite and whatnot. So there, nothing important was lost. So basically what I need now is, is, is a lot of the things I just mentioned. Well, I'll go collect that now because I need a lot of it because the, 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 the structure that I want to build, the thing that I have in mind is, uh, is big. And some of you maybe can see that, uh, yes, I got light Matica. I designed it in, in super flat and I was like, you know what, this looks way too good not to add. In, in, in the world so yeah we're doing it uh yeah so i have to flatten out a lot of area over there starting from that sand to like there's another sand in that corner yeah i'll get two more levels by trading sticks oh, god i wish the, the the strings guy was still there dude because i have a duper don't tell me i already had a guy for what are they doing up there no wonder people are stealing your jobs. Oh my god. Why are villagers so stupid? So I traded with this guy for no reason. I already had a guy. Come on. I just wasted a tree. Alright. No problem. Let's get me to level 30. Hello, mister. Are you the... Please don't run away from me. I'm not a bad guy. Just get as many as you can. Uh, efficiency for... Yeah, perfect that is absolutely perfect that's exactly what i wanted now that i have a decent shovel i'll start grinding away yeah i turned off the shaders because you know it's it's better to see without the shaders the shaders are just for cosmetics <laughs> Yeah. 
now it's gone well that was a good shovel i mean we got most of the things done we just need to like remove this one more layer and i think after that we're good he was a good he was a good kid he did so much for the world okay remind me never to do weird voices again i'm just collecting dirt and putting them in the chest because do not forget we still have a lot of holes to fill all right uh i collected most of the stuff uh, the only things that are left are like lanterns and a lactern other than that everything it's a lot so i'll build tomorrow and then hopefully in before friday the episode is out <laughs> Alright nerds, it's time to build. At this point I decided that doing the exterior first would make things much easier. I can just do the interior when I go inside. So that's what I did. I do apologize the audio of, of of this part got corrupted so i'm doing a voiceover right now whilst editing so this is me going into free cam and showing you that uh, i need to do some terraforming on both sides and uh, come on nerd make it quick and yeah it looks like kind of like a castle but like the up like the roof thing is is just there's no roof it's just cobblestone i will work on that of course, because I just I don't I don't want it to look plain. It looks way too plain. But yeah, this uh, this is the entrance. It looks a bit dark right now, but don't worry, I'll I'll work on that too. I just need to get some lanterns. Other than that, uh, yeah, the whole church is done. And uh, you'll see what what I'll I'm I'll be using this church for. Firstly, for you know praying. There you go. Yeah, good good job on placing it. The perfect. Good job, nerd. And now for my favorite part. Watch this. Watch this. Ah! Uh yeah, but this is the This is what I'm using this church for. It's 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 another portal and uh, I'm yet to decide what to do like build on the other side of the portal. But other than that, I think this looks like really good. Thanks everyone for joining. Thanks for staying. Thanks for watching another episode of Minecraft Hardcore and I'll see you guys in the next one. Hello my dear nerds, welcome to Minecraft Hardcore episode 3. Well, on the last episode, we, we built this church, which is not uh, finished, per se, and there's there's a gap right there. Th there's, a, there's a little bunch of things that we still have to do, for example, do something about the lights. So yeah, this was the church that we built. This is way too dark right here. And yeah, the church was... Uh, I mean, it's finished in spirit, but then there's there's like a little things that we have to do. You know, the lighting, and then there's like a thing behind the portal which we still have to do. So yeah, 
This is the church. Yeah, of course it started raining. No problems, no problems. And that's the house as everybody have seen. And there's a librarian which I was trying to get mending out of. But then I was like, wait, I'm not recording. Let me quickly do that. Everybody wants to see people break lecterns for, for six hours straight. Don't they? Anyways, you might be seeing like... You might be noticing there's a, there's a bunch of things missing from the house. The smithing table, the blast furnace, and a bunch of other job blocks. They're right there because I wanted this guy to sell me something good. So we're doing that. Let me get all the emeralds just in case. Why is he going upstairs? There's nothing up there. It's empty. I think there's a few chests. There's only one chest, not even a few. Oh, he wants my spruce wood. Go back, sir. And now he's not going to trade. Let me just quickly give you a list of the goals that I have. Can you stop pushing me? Thank you. I have to make a cobblestone farm using a TNT duper. And then I have to make a villager breeder because, you know, you, you can never get enough of these. And then make an iron farm because I also need a lot of hoppers for, for future projects. And you know, iron is always always a good commodity to have, so I'll do that as well. Then I need to get full protection for unbreaking three armor, and then I also want efficiency four or five tools, you know, because this is slow. Is it sleep time? It is almost sleep time for him, and then he's not going to restock until like 9.15. Don't I have a lot of uh, sugar cane somewhere? Well, I'm pretty sure I did, but no problems. I have some right there. Man, that looks... <gasps> that looks so good. Oh my god. This is awesome. See, uh, the, the thing I miss the most from like mid-game is, is Depth Strider 3. Because when you have that, you could just zoop zoop around in the water without any worries. This is slow. Now I also have paper. Because that's what I needed. There's the enchanting setup. The, the, the really good looking in one but no i need yeah i need paper you know in case there's a good trade that i want and then suddenly i'm like oh wait i need to lock the trade but then i can't lock the trade because oh i don't have a the thing that he wants and then i go and get the thing that he wants and then he now has a completely different trade maybe curse of binding or you know whatnot don't want that to happen all right it's time to work let's get in the stock exchange do you still not want to work? Can you start? It's nine! It's nine! There you go, they start at 8.55. That is stupid. Depth oh, come on. Don't do that. Punch one. Okay. Uh, let me quickly just make sure he can't escape with an emerald block because you know I'm rich I'm rich as heck let's get something good oh that is cheap that is okay that is cheap I have to get that because that is cheap that is so cheap oh my god but then I don't have mending huh Nah, I'm sorry, I can't. It is just cheap. It is just cheap. I It would be stupidity to not get that. Thank you. Thank you so much. This is good. I, I, I love you. Where's the other guy? Where's your friend? Oh. Hello. Uh, that's a stack. I spent 27 on, on, on... No, I didn't spend any. I just gave him paper that's smart all right i got uh 11 lecterns which yeah, it's a good start it's a good start i can now do things with them and then rest of the the wooden stuff can go in here i mean i do i do i really need the rest of the wooden stuff no i don't i should also do a little enchanting on a brand new pickaxe when i need i need a bunch of sticks why did i get a bunch of sticks i only needed like two well, that's okay. Let's quickly do an enchant on the new pickaxe and let's hope it's something good. Because we can do it twice. But if it's if it's like bad on both tries, I'll, I'll cry. Fortune 3 and Unbreaking 3. Okay. What if I got the other pickaxe, disenchanted that and hope that I get efficiency 4 on that. 
just efficiency four, not silk touch. I, I will be so sad if I got silk touch. Efficiency four, good. Oh, good, awesome. I got the good pickaxe. I just need a lot of iron now, which I can. Oh, I, okay, I don't have an iron farm. This is why I'm building an iron farm in this episode, so I don't have any. It's an important commodity, and I don't have any. Anyways, let's get started with the with the project. <laughs> Uh, okay, so I just found out a trick. Well, I didn't find it out. It's been a pretty old trick But you can just place the thing down there like their job blocks and they'll just go down there Sorry about the explosions. It's uh, it's it's a festival But you know what that gives me an idea. I can get so many villagers in here All right first things first we need to do a cobblestone farm. Oh, I should yeah, I should work on that because that was the plan. Where should I build it? I guess in the village since since I'm building my own village right here. This 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 whole thing is going to get destroyed. Um, what about somewhere around here? I just need a little flat area. Or maybe I could do it over there. Yeah, let's do it over there. Just need a flat space. It's it's a pretty good farm. It generates like um, 15 or 28,000 cobblestone per hour, which is pretty good. It uses like a weird trick to do TNTs, some prime TNT and some entity TNT thing, which is, you know, which some which is something I'm not intelligent enough to understand, but I'm intelligent enough to copy it exactly as it is. Or am I? Hey, Michael, we saw here. Uh <laughs> I'll just place the schematics. What is this? Is this no? I don't need the church one. I need the cobble farm. Which one is it? I think it's this one. No, I have to move it. I need sticks. Do I have any? I do have sticks. Good. Right here, or maybe here. Is that enough? Oh yeah, this is perfectly enough. So now, this is like a layer selection thingy. I have to place it first. Ah, I don't know how this mod works. Let's lock it, and then material list. I don't want to build using a tutorial, that's just lame. This is less lame, this is uh, a bit cooler when it comes to time lapses. Uh, okay, I'll figure something out. Yo, uh. what's good? Can you help me with something? You know how you place a schematic and then it just places? Yeah. What, do you see it? Turn off your shader. Is your schematic really just one layer? No, it's like... A few. I open the thing again. Go to the keybinds. Keybinds. Oh, okay. Um. Yeah, th that's like a really low layer. There it is. <laughs> yo, 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 we did it. Thank you, Dex. No problem. Thank you. Have Shout fun. out to Dex, everyone. He he's the one who does the footage. Uh, not the footage. The time lapses. All right. All see right. Ya. See ya. And now that that's figured out, I'll quickly go and sleep because I still don't want to fight mobs. And then we can just start building. Easy peasy. Would you like to sleep? He'd like to sleep. Yeah. But I'm not gonna let him. I wonder if I could place uh, trap doors. Perfect. Now I know where I hide him. Yeah, I know it's cruel, but it's 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 a game. They're not real. All right, let me show you. This is the cobblestone farm that I'm using. It's it's designed by uh, Big Booty One One Nine, if I'm not mistaken. And this uses some weird kind of TNT duping, but it requires a few observers. So I'll have to go to the nether and it requires lava but i don't think that will be very hard to find other than that it's just hoppers and cobblestone and that but that i can also make and a few leaves i, ca I can do all of that let's just do it layer by layer this first we can do that yeah but the oh yeah i don't have iron i forgot oh which is why we we're supposed to go mining now i mean i have a decent pickaxe don't i Yes, I do. See, eventually I'll combine them both. And that would mean I have a lot of... I have a decent pickaxe. Why am I saying all weird stuff? All right, let's go get some iron. All right, this is a mountainous area. This is where we get our cobblestone from. We won't need that anytime. Once soon, we will not have to come to this area for, uh, for cobblestone because we'll get the farm. Looking for iron. Eh, I'll take coal as well. Am I using the fortune pick? I am using the fortune pick. Good. Okay, so there's no iron on this mountain. That's sad. That is unfortunate. But there's a lot of uh, mountain areas nearby. There, there, there must be some around here. Oh, is that? That's copper. That is also copper. Wasn't iron supposed to be common? And oh my god, the terrain is so funky. I love it. I love this seed, man. I didn't even bring my compass because I there is no way I get lost. There is no iron anywhere. I don't understand. I don't want to go deep in the mines. But I guess that is our only option. <gasps> oh 
Was it just one? Oh, it was just one. No, it was two. Oh, no, it was three. How many did I get? Oh, wait, how did I just get three with the fortune pickaxe? That is so unfortunate. With this, this trip. I don't think I found this. No, I definitely haven't found, found this. Maybe there's a lot of, uh, there has to be like a lot of iron in this. It is there. Oh, let's go. Oh, let's go. Wait, I forgot I have the mod. I mean, I don't think it's still enough. Well, how much is that? Seven. Yeah, that's nearly not enough to get a full anvil, but you know what? It's a start. I just got lucky again. I just need paper. Where's the paper? Oh, I had, I had so much paper. I need paper. Yes, we got looting three. Now what I'll do is place that, and then this guy will go down there, and then break his original thing, and then break that as well. Now that guy's locked. Just break the bed, you know. <laughs> no! Alright, don't ask me how, but I managed. That guy's in there. That guy's in there. Now it's time for you, my good sir. Uh, it might be hard for you to believe, but this guy just has the mending trade for 24, which is, you know, expensive because the cheapest mending can go is 11. But, like, I don't have any problems with money. I can afford it, yeah. Alright, we got mending, looting 3 and sharpness five it looks like i'm going for just the sword but that's not true I, I i wanted efficiency as well but you know whatever you get first you just lock it now nah, now nah, don't forget i still need a lot of iron three is just not enough i mean i'll cook it but only for the sake of cooking do i have any more trap doors no i can make some all right time to not get sidetracked and actually get the iron that i need Nah. Okay, I was just recording and then it turns out the, my mic was like muted so that's that Never seen before nether adventure odd nerd I just need to make some more scaffolding. I think I left the the thing open. Oh my. That was oh wow. All right, so this this is a lot of emeralds. Anyways, now I need some bamboo. 
and some string which I also have we got everything now we just have to build it All right, time to sleep and then we build decks cue the montage Alright, so here's what's happening. It's weird because it uses like that and I have that. I'll have to do it manually. How do I have less number of blocks? I don't understand. At least I'll have a farm once I'm done with this. As annoying as it is. Where did I put my shears? Those as well. But where did I put my shears? like there's no way I, I i copied something wrong i did and i just forgot to place that one lava bucket yeah i just need to place the tnt I'm so done with life. Oh my god, I hate... I want to say I hate this game. But I genuinely don't. I I really can't figure it out. It uh, it, it just works in the in the creative world. This, this observer goes here, then it goes back. But then I think I'm missing a redstone. I mean, the chunks are still loaded. Why is this orange? Yep, this, this area is empty. And there's a... TNT here and then there's a there's an observer there the observer goes there and then the TNT goes there where I think this is also waterlogged at least it's supposed to be the problem is here was it just a missing piece of redstone dust I think that's what it was the missing piece of redstone dust do I have any I don't anymore Yes! 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 Oh, that took so long, but the farm finally works. Alright, now that the farm works, I'll, I'll go sleep peacefully. This, this took way too long, honestly. It's been like four hours. I did a little AF game. Like, it was like 40 minutes, I think. Let's see the results. It's like, uh... I would say three double chest full. But yeah, it's a pretty decent farm. It's supposed to be 28,000 cobblestone per hour. And yeah, I guess if you, if you add all of that, it should be at least 10 stacks. But yeah, that means I'll see you in the next video because uh, this is the outro. I know it's it's usually f three or four, four or five chapters, but uh, the, I think this is enough because it, it's way too exhausting to work on a farm. Anyways, Thanks everyone for joining, thanks for staying, and I'll see you nerds in the next one. Hello my dear nerds, welcome to Minecraft episode 4. We got this guy last episode, and we, we have absolutely no means of curing him and turning him into one of those. Yeah, also yeah, I got a, a texture pack, so the windows are clean and the bookshelves are 3D. Yeah, I also did a little bit of uh, terraforming. Not, uh, not exactly, it's just uh, I added these, I added a path going to the church, and you know, this is this is the nether portal. I added these slabs, so it's just, you know, it's you don't have to jump. This, this this is yeah this is it so far also in the last episode we went to the nether to get some 
nether quartz and uh, well to be honest that was it and we built uh, the cobblestone farm the automatic cobblestone farm which produces i believe 28,000 cobblestone per hour and i left it running for like a few minutes or so yeah that it works really well oh yeah i also got vanilla tweaks so it just shows you how which crops are grown i completely forgot i also did one more thing in the church i mean it still looks yeah i just added this like the redstone lights and then I, I mean i still have to do a lot i added two over there and i think that's it yeah that's all i did but yeah basically i thought that i had to build like a witch farm but you know what not everything has to be that complicated i just got a, a cleric and then he sold redstone he sold uh, um, the thing like the 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 glowstone and that was it you don't have to overcomplicate things by building farm for everything anyways in this episode i plan to clear out the whole village as in remove every building make sure everyone is homeless then dig a nice hole place a lot of beds in there and then just breed a lot of villagers because i'll need like 20 villagers for an iron farm that i'm building so this this entire episode is just going to be related to villager activities this grass is annoying i'm just going to re remove it all Yeah, at least you can see some stuff now. It's much better. You, you can see the things. It's clean. Look, this is exactly what I wanted. Also, yeah, this is the guy that helped me with the with the thing. I'll take more. Cause it's not like you could run out of emeralds, right? Ha ha ha! The string farm, not the duper. The string farm. It's a farm, not a duper. No, why am I not taking the path? The world feels so poor right now. One day we'll be rich. Okay. Perfect. We just have to do this everywhere. Except you can't because, you know, you ran out again. But you know, it's slowly getting better. Oh, okay. It's slowly getting better. These two are perfectly lit. That one is almost perfect. Perfection is my middle name. I was going the wrong way. In case everyone doesn't know, and I'm sure nobody knows because I don't talk about it, but this whole thing that I'm doing, like, you know, the house and then the church and then eventually there will be a graveyard. It's essentially because I, uh, I've i been playing a lot of this one particular game called Graveyard Keeper and I also streamed it in case you want to check out the VOD. Shameless plug. It's just at first I was like this game is so confusing it, it, I couldn't understand anything like what exactly am I supposed to do here but then once I understood like how the game works and stuff oh my god I became addicted and I could not stop playing. Anyways I finally finished the game it took me around 80 hours into or 83 hours into total and it's just it's it's just one of the best indie games i ever played so i i highly recommend you to check it out so basically what happens in the game is there's this buildings right so there's your house then there's the church there's the morgue where you perform autopsies and stuff everything is connected via underground network like of caves or not caves but um cellars let's just say that's what i want to do i want to build a lot of things like a tavern a library um a stock exchange where you know we, we, we will do all the trading stuff and then everything will be like connected from from the cellars or or the, or the caves i don't know what the word is english is not my first language but that's the plan i have for this world it's it's you know still it's very basic i still haven't placed that one stupid block i, I want to keep it as as real as it gets i don't want to go all loop well i got 16 trillion diamonds in in 100 days i don't want to do that i i want to keep it real i want to play it at a at a pace that's comfortable meanwhile also you know being interesting because i don't want the, the series to go boring and that can happen Happen if there's you know not enough content so if i feel like if i add a little bit of lore to the to my world uh it would not only be interesting for me to play it would also be nice for for people that are watching so that's that, that, that's the plan I, I hope everyone understands all right so it's the next morning not in real life just in minecraft in real life it's been like 20 seconds but yeah it's the next morning and uh you know i already told you what the plan was to clear out the whole village like every house just disappears all the beds are in in one place and then we just breed not we not 
we just let the villagers breed with all the crops that we have and probably they have as well they have a farmer so i can buy some stuff and just give it to them and it's not like i i have any money problems what should i start with huh exactly yes sir and the good thing is all all of the blocks that i'll get i can just use them for something else you know what, what do you sell you, yes you see this guy sells bread we can easily breed the villagers not him and i although i do need mending i i have mending don't i well i don't have a, a the thing yeah that's the issue i don't have the the the, the thing the uh, the anvil i don't have the anvil you know what goal one get the anvil i have five iron to my name that's 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 not going to be enough Ooh. How many do you need? So you need 27 for the for the three blocks and then four. So 27. So I need 23 iron. Yeah, there, but that, that shouldn't be very hard. I think I can do that. So let me go iron hunting. I'll fix it. The ravines used to be so much better. Now it's just copper everywhere. There's something over there. Oh, I didn't bring a bed. Now I have a lot of time. Hey, I remember that. It, is, isn't this where I got the calcite from in episode one? I think it was somewhere around here. So good news and bad news. I found the cave where I found the calcite. Well, you know what? The bad news is over. The, yeah, that was the bad news. I, I thought... Okay. How are we going to approach this? I have to get there. Oh, there's some over there as well. And some over there. Okay, I could just jump and then mine and then... Uh, it's been five minutes. I'm just talking about doing do, mining iron. But I still haven't even like entered the cave properly. Let's just go home. Sleep come back in the morning which is not going to be you know any better safety is very important so i'll just go home sleep wake up and then you know go north <laughs> that has worked really well for me in the past aha i have enough i actually have enough so this is perfect i can go home I, you see i always say dude north best direction i also made a diamond sword because you know you know, what if I try to enchant it? I mean, I have 30 levels. And it's not like levels are any hard to get. Looting 3. Oh, yes! Yes! This is perfect. This is actually so good. Oh my god, I love it. I'm not even, like, saying it ironically. I genuinely like smite on my sword. 3 iron blocks. Finally a furnace. Not a furnace, an anvil. Anvil goes in the middle because it took the most grinding and I first uh, I can't even see how many levels is that but shouldn't I get a mending book first I think I should where did my thing wait is it upstairs ah, that's three books uh, should I get all mending and so now I have the, the almost perfect pickaxe and almost an almost perfect axe which you know which I'll get eventually because again it's it's super easy to get xp uh like i said yesterday or or two days ago that i would be removing the entire village as to like the whole thing is flat is this time for a time lapse sponsored by my friend dex yes
a lot of the village has been destroyed. It took like two in-game days, which is like 10 minutes. I, I have pretty decent tools, so yeah. But yeah, that's uh, a few, like, um, what am I? What? That's gone. That all of these from this side are gone, except for that. I'll just burn that one. Cause it's way too big. And that one. Aqua affinity is good. I'll take that. Oh, fine. Okay. I'm, I'm, I mean, yeah, got protection for. By the way, just so it's clear, this trading hall is 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 not the the, the, the end game. I'll build a really good one. I have the design in mind. Don't worry, it's going to be really good. But this this is just temporary, so that we can you know get started with enchantments. Other than that, it's it's pretty good. I mean, it works for now. And again, like I said, I want the series to not be very paced, if that's the word. I want things to be going slow and smooth, not just like fast and unsmooth. I think I made that joke in the last episode as well, but it doesn't matter. All right, nerds, it's, it's the next day. I did some off-camera mining, but not for diamonds. That yeah, I just flattened out the ground and that's the iron farm. Thank you, phone. This is the iron farm that I'm building. As you can see, this design is like the most basic one. Basically, the, the concept is that the game counts any group of five villagers as a village. And the next one should be at least seven blocks away. So I assume it's seven blocks. If it's not, you know, it's just going to be a bit slower. And then same for that. And you don't need a zombie for that. It's like these, these golems are not spawned by zombies. They're just there because there's a group of five villagers in there. And that's basically the concept. And I've tested this in my super flat world. It's it's pretty good. It's like 800 per hour in 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 its worst case scenario. So yeah, I'll I'll take that. I mean, any iron is good iron in the beginning, right? So this is what we're building. All of the materials are pretty easy to get, except maybe the hardest thing is 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 waiting for the the glass to smelt. But yeah, other than that, we have everything. Now everyone has jobs. See, not only did I make them homeless, I also made them work for me. No, please, no, 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 you, no, you can't come here. Boo, boo. Why are they coming here? You have a whole village there. Why do you want the house? That is like 300 blocks. Why? The storage is done. Now I think I should start up the time lapse. Because, you know, it'll take me a while to build this whole thing. But for you, it'll be like two minutes. And I'm not using glass. I'm using a cobblestone because you know it's 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 pretty easy for me to get since i have a an unlimited amount of it now i'll do the the time lapse because i don't know why i just didn't record i mean i can never forget to press record right it's the next next day the golems might be mad at me because they are <laughs> no I, i'll just put on the helmet guess as it's the best kind of protection i've got i still have two more villager chambers to build and after that it'll be considered complete but these guys have to breed one more baby which is okay because we you know we have uh this guy not this wait yeah they're definitely mad at me let's see if the golems attack yep i'm sure that guy is also mad they'll help the last one very soon and i i guess they're doing it yeah, they, they are. It's all five. So this one is full. That one is full, I'm sure. Yes, it is. And then that one is full. So we just need to get that last one. And then the farm will start pumping at maximum speed. And if you're wondering why am I building without the shaders, it's just easier to see the, the blockies. It's about to be evening as well. And the ones that can go up there will go up there. Why is everyone going? No, stop stop trying to hurt yourself i can now delete the schematic and there we go working iron farm St a, a, a few inconsistencies like that block and then those blocks but inconsistencies are speciality see they, they spawn maybe it's not the fastest but you know what it works yes sir it's working like clockwork is is that what this i think that's what they say yeah, go in, go in, go in. We need more of you. There's two job blocks. Perfect. All right. Why did you take that one that you didn't need? Is there any other job block? No, I'll put 
this in there. Now let's do the exact same thing we have done over like 700 times because that's always the most fun part of Minecraft. Yeah, and also I'm 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 not going to fast for I'll just cut it to the the, the good the, the moment I get a good enchant. Uh he's selling soap touch. I mean I guess yeah sure why not? Alright. That's one more guy that's set up. Now we need to set up this guy. This is a joke. I mean 63? Just because I killed one of you? You know what? I I mean I don't have a bow yet, but power 5 or 30 is, is pretty good. I'll get that. Haha. <laughs> Alright. I'll 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 cut to when there's a good enchant. You know that didn't even take like a few seconds, sweeping edge 2. I'll take it. Should I? Efficiency 5 for, for a, a whole stack. Nah. Uh, you know what? Thank you. This is beautiful. Alright. I think I am pretty decked out. So this is this is a good setup. I'm turning off the shaders. right I am the guy I'll take the, the ghast here I mean, where should I be going there's way too many ghasts everywhere sadly I don't really have a recording for this but I do have a replay that I saved you son of a gun wait oh yeah let's go it's not that far like over there is the the, the portal Really looting three and absolutely zero. I am being very cautious because they like the the, the the wither skeletons do spawn in in like corridors as well. <laughs> that would make a fun YouTube short. No, they're trapped. Yep, I'm done. I'm fo I'm going to the opposite side of, uh, of 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 the dirt pillar that I made. First, I went that way. Now I'm trying this way, and I'm placing dirt blocks so I don't lose my way. There's a lot of way way. Is it that close? Ah, good for me. Yeah, it's pretty close. Well, we made it home. Thank you, Fortress. I wasn't recording my bad i thought i was recording but uh, i got i got an efficiency five for seven emeralds you know unbreaking is something i need still but you know it's just way too good to to skip so i didn't skip anyways i think i might be ending the episode right here as well because uh let's see our goals were build a villager breeder which i technically did then i wanted to get strong which i did protection four and then i also made some changes to my tools and my sword which is you know something i wanted to do and then more villager stuff i traded then i cured the zombie villager i now know where the fortress is 
and I got the blaze rods. Now I already have the ender pearl. So we are progressing in the game as well. Anyways, that was it. Thanks everyone for watching. Thanks for staying and I'll see you in the next one.